All right, hello. I <clears throat> am Ben Sandwich, and as you can tell, I'm a little bit under the weather. But no matter, I will be playing this game, the Stanley Parable, the demonstration, or the demo. I, I always said that. Sorry. Uh. Yeah, and I know that PewDiePie played this, so do not give me a whole bunch of comments saying, Oh, PewDiePie only played this, because I am aware of this. Um, and don't worry, I am a bro myself, so. Let us stop rambling, or let, eh. I will stop rambling now, and let us begin this game. Loading. Loading. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, whoa, oh. Alright. Oh, nice sound of music. Uh, do I go in here? Welcome to the Stanley Parable Demonstration. I'm not 28 years old. Your number is 28. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Okay, good. Wait a minute, I have to stand in line for this demo? Oh my gosh. Oh, please wait for your number. Oh my gosh. Whoa. Whoa. Somebody must have been really angry. Asshole. Guy should have cleaned up. This is not good. It's glitching. Sorry. Whoa. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Ooh. Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. Uh, it will be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at what to expect in the Stanley Parable. Okay. Jeez, just enough to leave you hungry for more. How exciting. Can't oh, you just dear. feel that nervous tension? The looming mm -hmm. uncertainty? Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment? Just I like drinking. 20 minutes or so. Please, for just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. <laughs> and let the thrill of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. <laughs> oh, I get it. You're too anxious. You can barely hold still. Well, tell you what. I think we should walk off that nervous energy before getting the demo underway. Oh? Uh? Why don't I take you on a little tour of the facility oh, oh. and show you how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. Oh, no. This is where I and the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is, <laughs> it plays, and why you should spend real-world money on the main game. Video yeah. game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect in the full version. Wait a minute, so I'm not going to ah, play the first mission. Here is one such technology. These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of a choice and the impact of the decisions you make. Whoa. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? Uh, Go did. ahead. Why don't you try picking one of these buttons to press, and we'll see what your choice says about you. Uh. Oh, boy. I'm gonna press random buttons! How fascinating. Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? Whoa! You see, our choices really do illuminate the very intangible nature of our minds and souls. Um... Pervert. <laughs> okay! <laughs> but I'm not a sexual predator! <laughs> what about this button? Oh, I can't press no more buttons. How oh, dare they say I'm a sexual predator. I'm not. Okay, what else can I show you then? This place is the buffalo of game design. Nothing. One of the most important parts of administering any demonstration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about I'm your not. sense of self-worth. 
That's why we use this room to develop cheap compliments to shower on the player during the demo. <laughs> Go ahead and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. Oh, this is hilarious. Love this art. My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single sitting as you can. Just look at you go. What? I'm gonna go press the other buttons. Now. Oh, this is so stupid. No, no, we've already seen this room. If no. it saves you the trouble of pushing another button, I can assure you that you're still a pervert. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Oh, I love this game. Ugh. Let me press a button. No, I'm not a pervert. <laughs> uh, thank you for addressing it, though. Actually, I don't know why that. Uh, oh no, that's an idiot too much. There's an idiot at my school that like just blabbers on and. Just like, just says random things that don't make sense. Kinda like I do. Now here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Go ahead, step into one of them, and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. Here we go and discover. It was though, and within, the shame he carried that ocean breeze did drift. The fierceness of the tides. The inevitable collapse of their kingdoms, washed ashore, bereft of shame, martyrs devoid of a cause, ripping and tearing at the eternal seams. A vessel without a captain, carrying itself like plastic in the wind, hinting at a purpose that was truer in some distant memory, if only it could decipher through time's veneer whose memory it wanted to be. <laughs> what did it be? Uh, courage. Oh, no, 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 no. Happiness. Where did these cliffs go? These crags that we stood upon, they shielded us from our own ignorance, spoke coddling words and wrapped our vulnerabilities in a woolen cloth that so many times I tried to set aflame. If I knew these comforts now, Stash. would their fibers be any more sensitive to the heat of my touch? Perhaps it was the cold I desired most of all. Comforted that empress ish. to whom my flesh was always invisible. A hammock for the bones, waiting to be touched and to be known. Sounds like the same thing as the discovery. Oh well. You went in both booths? Oh, how vulnerable of you. If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know and we can take a minute. I need to cry now. <laughs> You're inside a video game demonstration. Somewhere around here, there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. <laughs> of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. <laughs> top 4,700 even. I won't go as far as 4,600. Ah. <sighs> Calling me a pervert is a confidence boost anyway. Don't look at me like that. Stop looking at me like that. I hate you, smiley face. I'm pressing one more time. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is embarrassing. I really can't think of anything else to say. Uh, no, no. You've really exhausted my list of compliments. Goodness, that was fast. Either you or this department has a lot of room for improvement. 